the first uh, let's say it's the first uh, story that we will um, start uh, talking about. But before going to the story itself, we have to know the context of the story. And what is meant by the context? The context is the background of the story. Who is the author? What are the main, uh, let's say, um, elements or what are the the era that the author lived in and he or let's say was influenced by so edgar Allan poe is the writer of the cask of amontillado uh, we have to know that uh, i want to share the topic we have to know that edgar Allan poe uh, was born in 1809 uh, in Boston, Massachusetts. Uh, he is an American author, poet, editor, and a critic. So he was multitask, let's say, and he uh, is a part of the American Romantic movement. It is one of the most important things you have to know because we will see many romantic or transcendental uh, features or elements in the story, the cask of Amontillado. So he is a romantic, okay? He is a romantic author, a romantic poet, critic, whatever. And we have to know that he was one of the earliest American practitioners of the short story. He is a um, pioneer in writing short stories. And here, uh, some information about his early life, um, try to read about his life, but you have to know that he was an author, poet, editor, and a critic. He is a romantic uh, a poet or author, and he is one of the most important pioneers of the short story. So these are the most important things about Edgar Allan Poe. And in the next video, we will talk about his poetic style or let's say his writing style in general. And thank you for listening.